Hey guys, Takara here and welcome back to my channel. We are on episode 3 of The Walking Dead Season 10. Let's get straight into it. That is one big windmill. Here's my chick. What's those pills for? Has she told people that she saw Alpha? Aaron is looking on point this season. Gonna be freaking knackered full day now. Me. Shit, me. She's like another freaking wave. Where are they getting the walkers from to keep the waves coming? Because I know, like in the last episode, they did like a rounding up of them. So have they been collecting and storing these for ages then now? I have many a question, guys. By my estimation, we'll be fighting into the night again. Can't push him too much further. I have eyes. Whoa, Michonne. Sorry. Okay. Oh, sorry. she said sorry. It's okay. That's why she's my queen. She can admit when she's overstepped. The north border. Now. Call off your walkers. Not us. Yeah, right. Not us. Huh? Go to the border, lay down your weapons, and wait. Is this your mother? No. Oh, really? You crossed into her land. Again, you have to answer for that. You don't have to do anything. It isn't her. If she wanted you dead, she'd send the horde. All of it, not just a few waves at a time. Maybe she's trying to wear us down first. I wonder who's doing it then. The highwaymen want justice! <laughs> so all I want to hear from you is that you're going to take a dozen of us to meet these freaks at the border. And now we're going to take that just three kicking in. head off. What's your plan for taking them out? Oh, that wasn't rhetorical. I don't have one. Yeah, so you just pipe yourself down then, highway man. If she sends that horde, that's it. <coughs> right now, all she wants to do is talk. And we are going to listen. While well, Aaron will take some troops and handle the southern wave, breaking it up before it hits the wall. <laughs> that leaves us. And the border. Jamie Lannister should have took really no. If that was me, I'd end up with puncture wounds in my own leg. <laughs> Oh, what's Carol gonna do here now? Is she just gonna take, take a shot or? Okay, this is this is really tense. There she is. There is one rule between our people: you disobey. We crossed one time, three times, three. During the fire, you walked my land. And during the winter storm, you walked my land. During your search along the river, you and the man with the metal arm walked my land. Over the bridge. We are always watching. You have to be punished. Not yet, Carol. But there will be no bloodshed this time. So what do you want? land a creek that winds into the valley that is your new southern border we don't have to stand here and listen to this carol to this what this bullshit that's it come on we're done let's go we're not not until this one lowers her eyes to my feet alpha this carol you should fear me she doesn't know i don't i look at you and i feel nothing at all blonde boy screamed your name just before we took his head I apologize for my friend. We have not slept, and you know what she lost. I forgive you, mother to mother. This is my land now. Come on, let's go. I was getting, I was getting anxious then. I that was tense. There was some strong like Negan vibes then when she was like. And not until she lowers her eyes to my feet because he used to do stuff like that. Not about that life. What are these pills, guys? What are those? What are those? How poetic that the hands have been removed from the clock. Because time is an illusion in the apocalypse. Oh, she's cracking up. Hi. Come on. What are the freaking pills? I'll take first watch. Right. I don't think you should be taking watch of anything. Why take more? I'm sorry, but 
If I was taking a drug and then my mind started to go a bit funny, maybe stop taking the drug. No, I was just thinking about my dad. This one time, he was flying through Kentucky on I-66 and it's pitch black outside. He sees this girl up on the side of the road. Looks like she's crying. As he gets closer, the girl steps right out under the freeway right in front of his truck. He slams on the brakes, gets out and goes looking for her. Oh, she ain't there. How's that possible? Who's popping pills? There was no girl. See, my dad didn't sleep much either. You stay up that long, you start seeing things. I'm not a meth snorting truck driver like you. Whoa. Well, I think your dad, you know. Yeah, good luck getting out of that one. Not, not that your dad was one or anything. Harsh. No, you're right. Doesn't mean I'm wrong now. Is that blood actually going to be there though, or yikes? Mom. Oh dear. Oh, this is not good. Hi. You all right? <laughs> no, I'm not, Daryl. I'm. I'm not. Jesus. I'm fine. This isn't your dad seeing a ghost. What? It's the story of the girl. And your dad was a truck driver. My dad wasn't a truck driver. So all that was... Oh, and she's still got tablets left. Come on, don't take that. You're not learning at all, Carol. One more hour. Is it because she wants to see her son? Can she not shout for Daryl? Is this happening? Is it not happening? There we go. Cal. So did that happen then? She cut her arm real bad. Everyone is royally messed up after this, isn't it, apparently? You clamp, I'll go in. I'm fine. Yeah, you look it, lad. All this, like, I'm okay business. Why? Especially when other people's lives are in your hands. You just be like, look, I ain't well. If I'm not well, I can't help you. A smile. Hey. Hey. Oh, we need jam. Uh, She's dreaming. Some of the store. Hey. Money. Mom. Where are you going? That's really cute that she was dreaming about Daryl, though. Yeah, no smile now. She doesn't believe me. Do you? She knows he's lying. A whisperer, actual walker. So that's a walker wearing a walker skin. <laughs> Inception. So good episode. There were some really tense moments in it as well where I thought something major was gonna happen. It didn't, but the tension was still there so it felt good watching it. I love Carol. I hate that she's having these visions and seeing Henry and she's scared to sleep. And I do think it's cute that she's envisioning Daryl and that their relationship and things like that. But she's clearly struggling on a huge level. This revenge that she's feeling, it's gonna take over her. And obviously her lack of sleep as well is going to do some permanent damage. And this one-on-one -on -one battle that I wanted between Alpha and Carol isn't going to be sufficient if Carol Carol is already suffering and having this sort of, well, insomnia type of thing. She's not going to be at her best when she goes into this, this battle, if she ever does it, I don't know. Michonne handled the situation extremely well. She stayed calm. Well, she had a bit of a hiccup, but she stayed calm overall and she controlled the situation very well, as did Daryl as well. Well, I must admit. So if this isn't Alpha and Lydia was correct, where are these hordes coming from? Aaron as well, Aaron and Negan, th those scenes were quite tense. Is their relationship going to be even a thing now? Or they still hate each other and it's still not going to be going well. I have questions. But yeah, I'm going to get straight into the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, give it a cheeky thumbs up and subscribe, you know, if you want to. But there's no pressure here. And I hope to see you all again soon for another video. Thanks for watching, you guys. Bye.